It was about 45 learners that ended up in the street this morning after Principal Kavari allegedly suspended them. It is then when a few made way to the Namibian National Students Organization to complain. I got suspended because I asked the principal a question. I mean, my class is here to prove for a question. He started saying that I was being disrespectful to him. Maybe he felt like I was being disrespectful to him. But I have witnesses. All I did was ask a question and he felt like he was being disrespected. So he suspended me. When I'm here, I feel like I have no rights at all. That's all I want to say, thank you. My principal came this morning to my class and this is what he said. All of you that, did, and he pointed me out, he said to go to his office, get suspension letters, and then you go home. Not, nothing of a student card is mentioned in the rule book. Instead of maybe sending home the learners that don't have the tie since it's in the rule book, he's sending home the learners that did not pay $50 for, for, for the student card. I am one of the learners that are suspended because of a student card. Um, the reason being is simply because we didn't pay our student cards, but when we are telling um, our principal, Mr. Calvary, that we don't have money now to pay the student cards, he's telling us probably this morning he came to our class saying that, no, you guys should come to my office during break time. You're going to get your lectures and I'm going to suspend you. Principal Calvary, however, denied all allegations against him. They have indicated there that you are unwilling to listen to them. That is why we are here. They came to my offices this morning because they were very unhappy with the actions of your principal, Mr. Kavari, who decided that through this letter, um, because you have not paid your $50 for the student card, that you will need to bring in your parents tomorrow to decide on a cause of action that may lead to your suspension. As the students' organization, we exist to advocate and defend the rights of our students and learners in the country. And equally so, we are unhappy with the actions of the principal to have not consulted with the students' organization and not have brought in your parents before deciding to send you home over $50. I did not send you home immediately. So I have given them letters that after school you give this letter to your parents and tomorrow they must come. But if they can pay the $50, then they don't need to come. It appears there is more to the issue list than just that of the student cards. Will the government respond? If so, how? I guess time will tell. For the News on One, I am Francho Olafir.